Welcome to our channel. If you're looking to see how burgundy henna dye looks on your hair, stop right there. Actually, no, keep watching. Today we'll be doing a hair strand on burgundy henna hair dye. So if you're definitely looking how it's gonna look on your hair, keep watching. Now we've already mixed burgundy henna hair and, le and left it out for eight to 10 hours. If you'd like to see how to mix burgundy, please click on the link down below. All right, come on. All right, so we left out the burgundy for 10 hours already mixed, and we're going to first apply it to light brown. As usual, apply it from the roots all the way down. And when you need to wash it, you would wash, oh, this is, the hair's a little wavy today. And section your hair and then work yourself. All right, so let's go on to dark brown. Oh, dark brown doesn't want to be straight. Let's see if this helps. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I personally use burgundy and I just love how it comes out on my hair. And I would compare my hair to this dark brown strand as well. So I have a little bit of gray. I love how it shows. I love how it shows on my dark brown as well. I've tried the deep red and I liked it. I like the wine red too, but I think my favorite is the burgundy on my hair. That's... But ever since we did the other mahogany color, I wanna try that now. Okay, next one is the Plantinium Blonde. You can also, again, if you have gray hair, this is something you can look for a similar color what it will show after we wash it out. All right, so next one, medium brown with dark brown highlights. I want to see how this turns out. I'm always interested in seeing these, the ones with the highlights, how they turn out. Always surprises me. No, we don't want you over here. Stay in your place. Okay, so the next one is bleached hair. As always, on bleached hair, first application, if you like, if it comes out great. If not, then I always recommend doing a second application. Application. Um, especially when you have bleached your hair multiple times because bleaching your hair does damage your hair and henna always repairs it and then gives you the beautiful color you're looking for okay hop onto brown highlights with honey blonde color Wavy, wavy. All right, our last color, which is always the darkest we like to do, is we have black to dark brown hair. Again, never expecting 
to do a 360 change but always see that shine that glow in the hair you can still see the difference not in color wise but texture especially just love how henna works it's magic on no matter what type of hair you have never fails all right so we have applied on all our seven strands and we're going to leave it off for three hours put our saran wrap on it and wash it on we'll come back right after all right so we are back these was left on for three hours we washed them out and we left it for air dry we did not use any um blow dryer so right here light brown here's the original color and look how pretty this burgundy turned out and i'm gonna have to convince hillary now to use burgundy all right so here's dark brown oh so gorgeous i love how dark brown comes out and that's why i just love to apply dark brown on my hair so you can definitely see the difference plantinium blonde so you can also compare it if you have any gray hair and this is how it comes out now yes it it came out lighter and it's burgundy and on my gray hair it comes out to actually this a little darker version now if you want to go darker just reapply it uh gray hair tend to be stubborn so when it comes down to henna you know a second application will do the trick all right so brown with honey blonde right here the original color look how pretty this came this looks so pretty all right so jumping onto bleached hair and you can see it came out darker than actually the platinum blonde now if you want to go more darker again just do another application uh you can leave it on for three hours or an hour um and see how it works for you which color you like but i like this color all right so medium brown with dark brown highlight and this is how the burgundy turned out so you can tell the difference and to our dark color as always you will not see a 360 change, but definitely you'll see volume, you'll see that softness and shininess. So right there, and when you go in the sunlight, you're going to see red tints. So this is our burgundy hair stands. We hope you enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe for more.